putting satellites over China to putting satellites in the region to providing global coverage as of 2020. That is a very rapid advancement. It's not just seen as a military tool, it is seen as a tool of diplomacy. Today, we're diving into the exciting world of navigation. You know GPS, right? Well, we'll explore how other countries like China are creating their own cool navigation systems, giving the U.S. GPS a run for its money. The U.S. Department of Defense developed GPS as a revolutionary technology that transformed various sectors worldwide. From navigation and logistics to disaster management and precision agriculture, GPS has become indispensable for governments, businesses, and individuals. Think about GPS like a super smart map that started in the military but became super important for businesses and safety. The US Space Force manages it for defense stuff, but uh-oh, it can also be used for spying, which is worrying. Other countries saw how cool GPS was and made their own versions. Russia did one called GLONASS, and the European Union made Galileo. But guess who's really shaking things up? China's Beidou system. Beidou was local at first, then it went worldwide with the Beidou 3 satellites. It's just as good as GPS, especially in Asia. It's super accurate and useful for things like farming, transport, and phones. Plus, it works well with other systems from around the world. China is smart. They put Beidou in their big Belt and Road project. They're sharing it with other countries to make buddies and be a big deal in navigation. By 2025, Beidou could make China a ton of money, like $157 billion. It's going to help their economy and businesses by giving them great directions. The global navigation landscape is evolving rapidly, with China's Beidou system leading the charge in challenging America's GPS empire. As more countries develop their own navigation technologies, we can expect to see increased competition, innovation, and collaboration in this dynamic field. The journey towards a multipolar navigation landscape promises exciting possibilities for industries, governments, and individuals worldwide. Since the Beidou navigation system has emerged as a significant challenger to the GPS dominance, it's essential to delve deeper into its history and development. The Beidou system was first conceived in the 1980s as China's response to the growing reliance on GPS in both civilian and military applications. Initially, it aimed to provide regional coverage and improve navigation capabilities within Chinese territory. However, as China's global influence grew, so did its ambition for the Beidou system. In 2000, the Chinese government officially announced plans to expand the system into a global navigation network, similar to GPS. The first generation of Beidou satellites, known as BDS-1, was launched in 2000. Over the years, China continued to launch more satellites, with each new generation offering improved capabilities and coverage. The development of the Beidou system was not without challenges. Building and launching satellites into space is a complex and costly endeavor, requiring advanced engineering expertise and substantial financial investments. China faced technical hurdles, but its determination to establish a competitive navigation system drove continuous progress. By 2012, Beidou had achieved regional coverage and China had successfully launched the Beidou 2 constellation, which provided positioning service across the Asia-Pacific region. The Chinese government actively promoted the system's adoption in various sectors, ranging from transportation and logistics to precision agriculture and disaster relief. As the Beidou system gained momentum, it became clear that its benefits extended beyond China's borders. Other countries in the Asia-Pacific region expressed interest in collaborating with China or integrating Beidou services into their own systems. Beidou's increased interoperability with other global navigation systems further strengthened its position as a viable alternative to GPS. The adoption of the Beidou system has been widespread, not just within the region but also in partner countries involved in China's Belt and Road Initiative BRI. The BRI is a massive infrastructure project aimed at connecting Asia, Europe, and Africa through a network of transportation, energy, and telecommunications projects. By integrating Beidou into these initiatives, China seeks to boost its global influence and promote the widespread use of its navigation system. 
In recent years, Beidou has continued to expand its global reach with the deployment of the Beidou 3 constellation. This third generation of satellites offers even greater accuracy, robustness, and coverage. Beidou 3 includes both regional and global systems, providing reliable positioning services worldwide. The applications of Beidou span across various industries. In transportation, it enables more efficient fleet management, route optimization and real-time tracking of goods, leading to cost savings and improved customer service. In agriculture, precise positioning data from Beidou helps farmers optimize irrigation, planting and fertilization, contributing to higher crop yields and reduced resource waste. Telecommunication networks also benefit from Beidou's services, as it enhances network synchronization and timing accuracy. This is crucial for the development of 5G networks and other advanced communications technologies. Beyond its practical applications, Beidou plays a significant role in scientific research. GPS and Beidou enable real-time tracking of vehicles, improving route planning and reducing fuel consumption. For businesses involved in shipping and trucking, this translates into cost savings, enhanced operational efficiency, and more reliable delivery timelines. GPS-based navigation allows for more precise and streamlined flight routes, reducing congestion and enabling safer and more efficient air travel. GPS and Beidou help ships navigate through complex waterways, ensuring safe passage and enabling efficient port operations. Furthermore, these systems aid in marine surveying and ocean research, contributing to better understanding and preservation of marine ecosystems. Farmers can utilize GPS and Beidou data to create customized planting and irrigation plans, leading to optimal resource usage and higher crop yields. This approach not only increases productivity, but also reduces environmental impact by minimizing the use of fertilizers and pesticides. Satellite navigation is a key enabler of intelligent transportation systems. GPS and Beidou data are integrated into traffic management platforms, facilitating real-time traffic updates and adaptive signal control. This leads to reduced congestion, shorter commute times and overall improved urban mobility. While the current focus is on GPS and Beidou, other countries' satellite navigation systems are also gaining traction. The availability of multiple global navigation systems opens up opportunities for countries to choose the best suited technology for their specific needs. As we look to the future of navigation technology, several trends are likely to shape the industry. One key aspect is the integration of satellite navigation with emerging technologies such as artificial intelligence, AI, and the Internet of Things IoT. Picture this, a world where super-smart maps like GPS and Beidou have transformed everything. They help cars drive better, make farming a breeze, and even save the day during emergencies. These maps are like magic wands that boost efficiency, safety, and money-making for lots of people and countries. But guess what? The future is even cooler. Countries are teaming up to make these maps work together like a big helpful team. With super-powered satellites, clever computers, and smart gadgets, these maps are going to get even smarter. They'll do more than just show you the way. They'll predict things and be buddies with all your devices. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more thought-provoking content. Until next time, safe travels and happy navigating!